With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. In the given question, the angles of depression of two ships from the top of a lighthouse and on the same side of it are found to be 45 degree and 30 degree respectively. If the ships are 200 meter apart, then we have to find the height of the lighthouse. So here we first consider that the height of the lighthouse, that one is equal to x meter. So here this AB represent the lighthouse. So here let the let the height of let the height of here it is light house lighthouse that one is equals to here it is lighthouse that one is equals to x and then meter now we find out the value of this b c by using the trigonometric ratio in the right angle triangle a b and then c so here in the right angle triangle a b c we use the ratio 10 45 degree and that one is equals to perpendicular divided by base so here it will be a b divided by b c so here we get 1045 degree the value of that one is 1 is equals to a b we have considered it to be x and then divided by b c so here we cross multiply and we, and we get the value of b c is equals to x and then meter now we apply the trigonometric ratio in the bigger right angle triangle which is a b and then d so here here in in right angle triangle in right angle triangle a b d we use the trigonometric ratio that is 10 30 degree and that one is equals to a b divided by b d so here it is a b divided by b d so that will be equals to a b and then divided by this b d can also be written as b c plus c d so here it will be b c plus c and then d so now we simply put the value so here the value of 10 30 degree is 1 upon root 3 is equals to here the value of ab we have considered it to be x divided by the value of bc we have find out that one is also x meter so here we get x and then plus the value of this cd is 200 meter so here it is 200 so now we simply cross multiply and here we get x plus 2 100 is equals to root 3 and then x so here we get 200 is equals to root 3 x and then minus x so here we get the value of x is equals to 200 and then divided by here it is root 3 minus 1 now we rationalize the denominator so here we multiply numerator and denominator by root 3 plus 1 divided by here it is also root 3 plus 1 so here we get x is equals to 200 and then root 3 plus 1 divided by here we use the algebraic identity according to which a minus b into a plus b is equals to a square minus b square so here this part is a and this part is b so here we get root 3 square minus 1 and then square so here we get x is equals to 200 root 3 plus 1 divided by here root 3 square is simply 3 so here we get 3 minus 1 so here we get 200 root 3 plus 1 and then divided by here it is 2 so this 2 cancel this one and here we get 100 so here we get the value of x is equals to 100 root 3 plus 1 so the height of the tower height of tower that will be equals to x and that one is equals to 100 and then root 3 plus 1 meter so here that's our answer for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.